she was gonna freaking attack me. Oh, what the fuck? Some items need to be charged with energy before they can be used. Pick up the laser pistol. Now use the recharging station nearby. The recharge station will juice up all of your energy-based items. Weapons, batteries, you name it. Okay. Weapons are not fine wines. They do not get better with age. The colored dot on the lower right corner of the screen tells you what kind of shape your firearm is in. Green is good, red is bad. To fight the effects of wear and tear, a soldier with maintenance skill can use a maintenance tool to improve the condition of his weapon. Just pick up the tool, open your inventory, and drag the tool onto your pistol. Remember that maintenance tools are only good for a single use. What number is the laser pistol? Oh! <laughs> you know that they make the tutorial with only lines? It actually looks kind of fuck ass creepy. Is my mic on? Yes, it is. Good work. Now you're ready for the Marines. Take a look at the other training areas first before you enlist. They might just come in handy. Let's go. Welcome. You'll notice when you're in the Cyberlink booth, we'll provide Please. you with a temporary cyber interface and the skills you need to accomplish the training tasks. But they'll only last so long as you're in the booth. Oh no, 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 don't tell me you're fucking that yellow guy from Star Trek. I'm gonna kill you once I first find you, you fucking bitch. The object in front of you is a container of nanites. Nanites are consumed whenever you perform technical tasks, such as hacking or repairing. When you pick up the container of nanites, they do not go in your general inventory. Ah, what the hell? They are instead displayed in use mode on the bottom left of your screen. Walk over to the keypad by the door and try out hacking. Use the keypad by right-clicking on it. To the right of the number pad, you'll see an orange tab labeled Hack. Left-click on the tab. Text will appear indicating the difficulty of the hack and any bonuses that apply. Click on the start button to begin hacking. You'll see a grid of nodes. Clicking on a node will either turn it bright or dark. To successfully hack, you must connect three bright nodes in a straight line. Beware the ice nodes with the red outlines. If one of these turns dark, you fail the hack and you might break the item you're working on or worse. You can restart your hack attempt at any time by hitting the reset button. Though you'll have to pay the nanite cost again. Ah! Oh, cool. Hey, bitch. What, what the fuck? What, what, what? Uh, hey, I opened it! I opened it! What the hell, I opened it! You know, let me go in, you damn fucks! Fucking bastards! There! Damn fucking bitch! Oh! You can use nanites to buy items from replicators. To use a replicator, right-click on it, and left-click on the item you wish to purchase. The item you purchased will drop into the slot below. Make sure you pick up your purchases before you leave. Thank you for choosing Value Wrap. Ooh, I want to save. Light. Hi there. Please make your selection. Hi there. Please make your selection. Reinitialized. What did that mean? Oh, it gets cheaper. Cool. Thank you for choosing value wrap. Thank you for choosing. Thank you for choosing value wrap. 
Thank you for being such a slutty whore. I know who your voice is. I know, I know, I just forgot your name. Slutty whore. You learned the basics of the technical skills. There are several other technical skills you'll learn throughout the course of your career, such as repairing items and modifying weapons. Fucking teach the me that. interfaces for these tasks are similar to the hacking interface. Before you enlist in the Navy, try out the other training courses. They'll be useful. Why can't I be like a jack of all We've trades? We've provided you with a virtual... The red bar at the lower left of your screen tells you how many Psi points you have. Psi points symbolize the current ability to use your Psi powers. Psi hypos replenish your Psi points. Try using a Psi hypo and watch your Psi points what increase. What the fuck? When you've reached your maximum all my Psi shit's points, gone. move to the next station. Ah, I thought I'd keep those things. Man. That's why I bought all those shit. All those bullets and fuck. What was the damn point then? <laughs> what the fuck? A black ops sign again. This psi amp amplifies your psi powers and lets you project them into the real world. To equip it, pick it up and then hit the tilde key. Firing the Psy Amp activates your currently selected Psy Discipline. You currently have access to two disciplines, Cryokinesis and Kinetic Redirection. Go into Use Mode and click on the arrows on the bottom right of the screen. This will cycle through your available Psy Disciplines. Later, clicking on the arrows above the number to the left will allow you to select Psy Disciplines from higher tiers. Use cryokinesis to destroy the robot, and kinetic redirection to pull that nanite container towards you. Be careful. Holding down the mouse button can augment the power, but holding it down for too long will cause burnout, which will damage you. Oh. If you run out of psi points, use another psi hypo. Which launches a heat drain. High RP psi increases damage. Try for first and increase your item psi points. I... Let's go! That is awesome! Come here! I am a fucking Jedi! I am a fucking Jedi! What the fuck? Oh, well, you know what? fuck you. I'm gonna do this again, bitch. I am gonna do this again. Join the dark side. Fuck you and and. Yeah, whatever the robot's name is, fuck you. Mastery of the mind is a slow but rewarding process. Fuck yeah. Return to this area if you need more guidance. Before you en- Here's where you make your choice, soldier. Here's where you enlist in one of the three branches of the military. Once you decide on your branch of service, there's no going back. Oh, the shuttle will take you to a UNN orbital space station, where you'll receive a briefing regarding your yearly postings. Good luck. Fuck the Navy, the Marines, or the I'll say LSA. Dude, the magic team was awesome. Like squeeze, or use the fucking guns. Good old Canadian guns. Oh, I'm gonna stop the let's play right here. I'll continue again next time. This is Shadow Light X9 with. A blind let's play of System Shock 2. So far, it's not that scary. I might love this game. Ooh, can I go down? 
Oh. Alright, bye bye. And. Oh, sir!